Ladies and gents, Kairara Kazaha has been rumored and speculated to be returning in Genshin Impact 2.8. Now, why that is considerably important is because Kairara Kaza is going to be coming alongside another animal user we all know as Shika no Win, who was teased by Genshin Impact's Twitter account not too long ago. Now, this means that Genshin Impact's 2.8 patch is going to have two animal characters. And this is a little bit interesting. Now, we already know how good Kaida Harakaza is being a support animal character that shreds absolutely every resistance possible. And not to mention also gives you a buff alongside that as well. Kaida Harakaza is one of the most fun Genshin Impact characters. Meaning, if he does return in 2.8... There's going to be a massive amount of people that want to be summoning on his banner because, well, Kaza is awesome. He's super fun to play, and not to mention, he is really, really powerful. Now, because of his superb performance and gameplay, that means people are going to be summoning for him. And does that mean that Chicken Owen is going to be summoned on or not? I'm not quite sure, but I personally am really excited for his arrival to Genshin Impact, and I'm going to be summoning on him as soon as possible. Not only is he an animal character, but he is also going to be around the same time as Kaidar Kaza, going to be a fun, fun time. Now, I think he is going to be as good as Kaidar Kaza if he was to be a support character, being that he might have a sword, but if he doesn't have a sword, let's say he has a claymore or something, it'd be a little bit different. However, if he has a sword, or maybe even a catalyst, he's going to be an awesome character for sure. Now, we've seen so many characters being a support. For, for example, Sucrose, for example, Kaidar Kaza, Venti, they're all characters that support your main DPS. Now, we've had only one character that's a main DPS in the animal, and that is Yao. Yao is such an anomaly in Genshin Impact that it would make sense for them to release maybe another animal character that also does DPS. So, what does that exactly mean? I'm not quite sure, but I'm really excited to see what they do with this animal character because animal has insane potential. With mobility, with damage, with everything like that, and what has to be the most fun element in the game currently, and I cannot wait to see what they do with Shikana Win. Obviously, we have a lot of time until he does come out to the game, so all we can do right now is speculate and see what kind of stuff he might have in his kit, as well as a lot of rumors and leaks or whatever like that. But I don't think we're gonna be covering that too much into detail. But all I want to say is that you're going to want to save a lot of your gems for these two characters because they're going to be a lot of fun to be had. Not to mention Genshin Impact 2.8 is also rumored to have like the new islands and stuff. So if that is true, we're going to have an awesome time in Genshin 2.8. Now, also beware Genshin is probably trying to make you spend on these characters in 2.8 because right after 2.8, we're probably going to have 3.0 Sumeru dropping right after. So because of that, we might also have to be really careful about how we spend our gems here. Because if we spend it a little bit too much, we might not have enough for the character that we might want in 3.0. That is a very important point I wanted to get across to you guys as well. Obviously, if you like the characters, summon for them. If you can't get those characters, it's unfortunate. Hopefully, we get the reruns. But for now, these are the characters that will be coming up in Genshin Impact 2.8. I'm really excited for that. It's probably going to be a really fun patch. And I'll be covering it all on my channel here on Mars 26. And finally, stuff to talk about and stuff to go on. Because it's been a long drought. And I um, mean, it makes sense why we've had a long drought. And it's fine. We move on. And I'm really excited for these two characters to come to Genshin. Are you excited for these characters to come into Genshin Impact? Let me know in the comment section down below. As well, like this video as well. Subscribe to the channel. Help me reach a thousand subscribers. I'll see you guys in the next video very soon. Bye-bye.